Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Drawing with Miss D. So, today's a new month, the month of June, and this month's theme is going to amusement parks or theme parks. And we talked a little bit about that, about which one was your favorite, which one you've gone to. So today we're gonna draw something like an amusement park. You can decide which one it wants to look like, either Disneyland, Knott's Berry Farm, SeaWorld, whichever one that you've been to that you like. So we're just going to draw ourselves in front of some rides, just like you would see at a theme park, okay? So you'll need a piece of paper, like this one. If you want lined piece of paper, that's fine. If that's all you have, that's fine. If you have this, that's okay. I have my colored pencils here and my Highlighters, you can use crayons, markers, color pencils, watercolors, whatever you have, okay? And a black Sharpie if you like. And a pencil with an eraser. Okay, get your paper and we're gonna flip it sideways because we wanna draw the most that we can right here with our theme park or our rides, okay? So we're gonna start with first our face right here. So we're gonna go right on the edge, like right here. And we're gonna draw ourselves in front of a ride. So start with the head first, draw a circle, and then we're gonna shape it. This is just sketching it, so let's sketch our face. If you wanna use a mirror, that's fine, so you can see how it, your face looks like. And then we're gonna draw big eyes, because you're super excited, right? We're super excited. And then our eye. So we can draw different styles. Last week, I drew one style. The week before that, I drew facial features differently. So I have different styles that I draw, either like realistic um, or like cartoon-like, okay? So this is gonna be more like cartoony. And this is your mouth, wide and open because you're excited, you're happy, and then your tongue, your teeth. Okay, and then I'm gonna do my hair like this to the side. You do your hair how you like, okay? This is just pretty much a sketch of yourself. Okay. However you like, it's gonna be some, somewhat like a cartoon, so it's gonna look a little different, okay? Okay, and then we have that. And then I'm gonna do my shoulders coming across like that. Cause I'm gonna have my hands up in the air, all excited, right? This is your elbow coming down. Your elbow's right here, another elbow. And your little fist, your little fist. And then my shirt. And you're just drawing it right now, you're sketching it, so it's gonna look a little funny with, with a lot of lines, and then you can go back and erase them with your eraser, okay? However you like. Don't worry about that, okay? So when you're excited, you have your fist closed, right? Just try your best, you guys. I know it's a little difficult to do fingers and hands and all that. Don't worry about it. Okay, so that's me right there. Hair's crazy, I'm screaming, I'm excited, I'm happy, I'm at a theme park. And then behind it over here, we're gonna do a roller coaster, okay? So let's do that first. We'll go back to this, don't worry. So that's me or that's you, whatever you wanna draw. Let's, let's keep drawing below. Just like that and we're gonna draw a roller coaster so let's start right here by the hand and it's gonna go like a little loop from here we're gonna go up okay and it's gonna go up and just like that hold on just like that 
just like that, okay? It's gonna end right there because we're gonna move it down. So it's like curving right there, it's turning. You'll see right now. So that's a loop and then we're gonna do like another piece because it's like a rail where the, what is it called? The little, the ride cart, the cart that you ride on goes. And then behind it, it's another loop right here because it goes up and down and all around, right? And it kind of goes down, crosses over. And see how it's kind of like curvy right there, it ends? Because it's turning, right? So we're gonna continue right here. Same thing. And somewhere right there it disappears, right? So now, let's go back to the edge and we're gonna pull a line down, okay? We're gonna draw it down, going down. So these are like the big bars that hold the roller coasters, right? If you see when you go on a roller coaster, there's always a lot of bars and um, things like that holding up the actual ride or else it wouldn't work. It has to be held up or else there wouldn't be a ride. It would be on the ground. But you need all these bars to hold it up to be really, really high. Right? And then we're gonna cross in here and here. Don't worry, we'll erase that later. Okay, keep going. So about one, two, three, four, five bars holding that. And let's go to the one in the rear right here. And we're gonna have like two. One, and then two. Okay, so it's gonna go up and then down and then it connects and it goes down over here. You can make it however you like. Make it fun, okay? So once it goes down, it goes downward this way. So I don't know if you can tell, that's how the rides are, right? It goes up, then down, then up, and all that. And then it connects over here too. I'm not a big fan of roller coasters. When I was younger, I did like them, but now I choose not to get on them. I'm not scared, it's just, it just makes me feel a little sick. So I'd rather not go on them. Okay, so there's your roller coaster, guys, right? Make it however you want to look like. It doesn't have to be perfect. Okay, so there's you, a roller coaster, and then we can add maybe one of those little carts. I don't know what is it called? A cart? A ride? The car? And then you have people in there, right? Just draw little circles. Since they're so far away, we can't see them, so we're just gonna draw little circles. You may can draw somebody's hair, since we don't know who they are, right? Little hands in the air, because they're ready to go down, right? Something like that. Okay, now over here, we're going to do a Ferris wheel. A Ferris wheel, it's a different type of ride and it's more calm and relaxing. And instead of going up and down and in all kinds of loops, it's only gonna be round and round. It's kind of like the merry-go-round, but the opposite way, instead of going around this way on the ground, you go up in the air, up and down, up and down. So it's right here behind well, this is me, so you're gonna draw yourself. And so behind your head, you're gonna draw this big circle like this. And then another line by your hair or close to your arm. And you're gonna start going up, all the way up, make it high. And then come around where it touches the other side of your arm. Oops something like that. So it should connect, if you see it, it should connect like that, like a big circle, like a donut, right? Like that. It should connect right around there. And then we have to do the part where it connects the seat. So you have to do another line. So it starts like that. And 
And since it kind of disappears, it overlaps, it comes back this way, thicker, all right? Okay, now we're gonna draw the seats where you sit. They're like little, like little baskets, all right? You can just draw, it's like an oval. Like a, not a perfect circle, it's like an oval, the shape of an oval. It's a little longer. Okay, something like that. Can you see that right here? Okay, now those connect to the actual Ferris wheel, right? So we have to do like a little basket which connects it. Okay, it's always connected or else the rights would fall. And things like that can happen. It's just like a metal part. Okay, now go back to the circle in the middle and we're going to connect this to your actual, actual Ferris wheel, okay? For this, you can either use your own pencil or what I like to do is use something with an edge if you don't have a ruler, you can use a ruler. If you don't have a ruler, use the edge of a book, edge of a paper. I use edges of boxes, anything that you can find. And then we're going to start right here. And then just connect it to the seat, to each seat. So I see a seat right here. I'm going to connect it. Okay. There's another seat right there. Connect it. And you see what I'm doing? It's not just two lines. It's It starts really small right here. And when I'm going over here, I stretch it out further apart. So over here, it's gonna be more close to each other than over here because that's how it works with the actual Ferris wheel. Kind of like, kind of like a pizza. I don't know if that makes sense, like a triangle. There's a lot of, a lot of math involved when it comes to building rides and houses and buildings it's a lot of work but we don't have to worry about that we're just drawing okay okay Careful with your hand right here. Don't overlap it if you can. And if you do, don't worry about it. Erase it later. So right here, I'm gonna go where my hair's at. So I don't wanna do that. I'm just gonna, I'm just going to like pass it over so that I don't have to sketch over it. Okay. Right here, last one. That's all I had to do. Okay. So there's me all excited. My roller coaster, my Ferris wheel. And then on the bottom we can draw like people walking around. So you get like an idea of who's who's riding which ride or what. You can draw people in the back. Do little stick figures, right? All right guys, so now use your Sharpie or black marker or a black crayon if you want and outline everything, okay? Once you line, outline everything, you're gonna come in with your colors, okay? And then once you come with your colors, do whatever you want for your outfit or for your hair, your body, whatever. But for the rides, try to do bright colors. I don't have a lot of bright colors in my colored pencils, so I'm going to use a lot of my highlighters because it's more bright. But for some of these, I'm gonna use um, this nice red that I like, okay? So I'm coloring in the the little seats for the Ferris wheel. 
And I know they come in different colors, but it's up to you. You guys decide what to do, right? do this red also the middle part which connects everything puts everything together okay and I'm gonna use this green color to do the top part that connects the seat okay and you know what a lot of rides don't have a lot of colors but I've seen like at the Strawberry Festival in Orange County Fair, where there's a lot of color in some of these rides. And guess what? Look, it looks like a strawberry, huh? Green and red. Cool. All right, I'm gonna do the. I'm gonna do this part, black or gray, whatever color you have. Since it's all metal. Okay. you guys take your time I know I'm doing it fast for you guys but take your time okay okay so there's the ferris wheel and I'm gonna do the same with the gray or black that you have if you don't have gray or black or any markers or crayons Use your pencil, the pencil that you have. Every time you sketch with it, it's like a gray color. So go ahead and use your pencil, you guys. And if you don't have any of those, just use whatever color you like, whatever you have. Okay. I haven't been on a roller coaster Ooh, in years. I don't remember the last time I got on one. I think Disneyland, but not these kind of roller coasters. They were more like little rides. But like big roller coasters, like scary ones, it's been years. And I'm not planning on getting on any of them soon at all. Little kid rides, maybe I'll do, but not these roller coasters it's scary i'm not scared but it's scary you know i get sick and then i'm not trying to get sick when i'm out having a good time okay there's your roller coaster color the little people whatever color you want and there's me with the ferris wheel all right let me use Highlighters. Let me see, let me see. I don't have brown, so I'm gonna use this brown for my hair. Okay. Color, 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 color. Color, color, color. Okay. Eyebrows, eyebrows, eyelashes. Okay, and then I have my pink highlighter because I like the color pink. Blue pants. Okay, and then for the Ferris, not the Ferris, well, the roller coaster, I'm gonna have little lights on it. If you guys use highlighters, it always makes it seem like it's like uh, little lights because it's so bright. And I always do little dots. They're like little lights to me on top of the Ferris wheel. The Ferris wheel, the roller coaster. Sorry. 
don't know if you can tell. Okay. Usually the, the yellow highlighter is more bright. Okay, is, can you tell? So it's supposed to be like little lights. And then same thing with the Ferris wheel, there's always like little lights. There's always lights. If you guys have a bigger highlighter, that'll help. These are mini size, so it's way smaller. And I do like little circles. Something like that, right? So yeah, so here we have the Ferris wheel. You, super excited, and then your roller coaster. You guys can add more people, maybe like a popcorn stand or like a ticket stand, maybe a friend or a brother. Um, more people over here, people walking, maybe some clouds or a sun, whatever you like, okay? So as soon as you guys are finished, let me see, upload it, okay? I wanna see how you guys do yourselves at a theme park. And then also let me know what theme park you went to. So this one, I mean, I like Disneyland, but this one reminds me of when I went to um, the OC Fair. So I'm gonna write OC Fair. Because I don't think I've seen roller coasters at Disneyland. All right? All right, when you're done, post it so I can see, all right? All right, thank you guys. Enjoy. Bye.